Top of the morning, folks. It's Wednesday, November 15th. I'm meteorologist Jim Howard, and this is your latest WITN uh, first alert forecast. Bark, yes. Bite, no. Uh, clouds, yes. Rain, nope. Uh, no worries. Air temp to about 63. Yesterday, we had about 65, maybe down a click or two with that increased cloud cover today. Chilly 30s out the door again. Could be a touch frost early, and the winds under 10 out of the northeast. That's your condensed cliff nose version forecast. Uh, cloudy, but no rain, uh, chilly to cool. All right, there's the cloud deck. I'll roll it through the overnight. Mid-level clouds, not a thick, heavy, low uh, rain cloud deck. Mid-level, fairly shallow clouds, but enough to block out a fair amount of sunshine through the day. And again, cut those highs a little bit. Rain again, 0% today, tonight. Tomorrow, a little chance, maybe on the coast, a stray raindrop. Uh, the much better rain chances come in Friday, more so late Friday into Friday night, the way it looks right now. All right, air temps, I'm going to say upper 30s out there. That's through sunrise, kind of holding around 38 until we get past sunrise. That's sunrise just before uh, 7 a.m. Not much wind, uh, northeast, I think under 10 on the winds today, maybe a touch over on the coast, but all in all, uh, we'll keep most areas in the single digits. Same thing tomorrow, Wednesday relatively light, northeast to east, in fact, calm in the morning, afternoon wind at about five or so. I think tomorrow, as the sun starts to come back out a little more, we'll get that high up towards a 70, 71 degree uh, peak tomorrow afternoon. It's a little warmer. Uh, air temp today, 63. There's my 71 tomorrow. And again, a few, little more sunshine getting out tomorrow as we go through the day and still generally rain free. Uh, save an isolated coastal shower. I'll show you that as we stretch the map out. Light raindrops from Atlanta down into the Florida Panhandle, from Charleston down into Jacksonville, uh, Florida. And again, taking the low road primarily. We'll catch some of this rain, but the bulk of it uh, stays off the coast. Uh, here we are later today, all quiet. Uh, Thursday, again, still some clouds around, but rain unlikely. Uh, you can see those clouds kind of hanging in there north of that low. Watch that low kind of round uh, the horn, moves off the coast of Florida, tracking off of our coast. Here's Friday afternoon, stray shower or two, evening hours, few showers through the overnight. That low kicks out to sea as we head into Saturday, and this front comes through right behind it. So we'll bring some cooler air in, drier air Saturday afternoon. Could be a coastal shower Saturday morning, not much though. Uh, generally overnight hours, Friday night, best rain chance. Get into Sunday, uh, sunny skies. We'll be watching this next front back to the west. Looks like Tuesday, Wednesday time frame uh, just before Thanksgiving. A chance to rain out of that. Today, clouds but no rain. Same thing tomorrow, 63 to 71. Another 70, 71 on Friday. Rain chance 60%, probably more p.m. into the overnight, maybe 70% Friday night. Looks like a quarter to a half an inch of rain in there. And then that rain's moving out Saturday morning. Adios. Uh, as the sun comes up, rain departs. Drier air comes in. Highs in the upper 50s Sunday. Still in the 50s Monday. Back to the low 60s in the middle of the next week. With another rain chance coming in Tuesday into the big travel day on Wednesday.